Albion confirms that the explosions seen in the skies over London were indeed an Albion drone project that was sabotaged by the DedSec insurgency. In an exclusive interview with GBB Radio 1, Albion founder and CEO Nigel Cass had this to say. Truth is, the supposed freedom fighters of DedSec have made London less free. That drone project was meant to replace Albion boots on the ground, let the city get back to normal. But now, I can't in good conscience stand my people down. That's not how I lead. Cass went on to implore listeners to treat any suspected dead sec operatives as terrorists and to immediately report them to Albion. That lying fuck! He was about to kill everyone who'd even think about standing up to him. And now he says he's a victim. And it's working. Sorry, that was too cheerful. Sadly, it's working. Too sad? It's what he does. Scares the shit out of people, then swoops in and plays the hero. We've got to show them what he really is. So that's his weakness, his image. If we shatter that, he falls apart. Actually, we've been thinking about that. Bagley, on screen. This is Claire Waters, political dissident and podcaster, reported missing after teasing a salacious upcoming episode. Sadly, it never aired. So all we have is this. On the next episode of Buccaneer Radio, I'm chatting with someone from deep inside Nigel Cass's inner circle. He's promised me something that will expose Cass as the tyrant I know he is. This is going to blow the roof right off White Tower. See you next week, pirates. Nigel would have spun that interview if it was spinnable. If he went after Waters for it, that tape's a smoking gun. We've got to have it. Claire was known to broadcast out of Freight One. You should begin searching there. Claire Waters appears to be an equal opportunity muckslinger. Albion is her target of choice, but she's railed against tech genius Sky Larson, SIRS, and Plan Kelly. Opinionated, isn't she? Yeah. Well, imagine the shit she could disturb with dead tech on her side. We should find her. Have a chat. She's been digging in Cass's shit for a while. If what she has isn't enough to squeeze his bollocks in a vice, Possible hostile at your location. Investigating. Stand by. Control, there's been an accident. Send assistance. Any other patrols have eyes on the suspects over?
Claire used to broadcast from somewhere around here. That's all I've got, I'm afraid. Bloody analog technology. For someone with fuckloads of enemies, she's way too easy to find. Or maybe we're just too smart. Ugh, we should hurry. Fucking hell, someone's killed her. This is bullshit. Why does it feel like the bad guys are always winning? I'd love to listen to you moan all day, but perhaps investigating her murder would be a better use of our time. I know, I know. It's just shitty. Obviously, we're going to find out who did this. We need to know whose stupid face is to fuck up. Bags, what do you think of this graffiti? Bit flashy, yeah? Claire did release several podcasts critical of Clan Kelly, which you'd think they'd be used to by now. They're a criminal gang. They shouldn't expect flowers and thank you notes. I don't know. Clan Kelly are murderous goons, not bragging idiots. Yelling, we did a crime, isn't really their style. Hey, footprints. Do that CSI shit on them, Bagsy. Several individuals. Boots rather than shoes. One with a tread unique to a certain paramilitary supplier. I think it's from their autumn collection. Hmm. I wonder who they supply. Albion. Nice. Those assholes didn't get her tablet. Might be our lucky day. Can you scan it, Bagsy boy? Tablet unlocked. Claire seems to have logged conversations on it. Okay, you've agreed to speak on the record. You are an intelligence technician at Albion and work closely with Nigel Cass, correct, Mr...? Just you. I can't believe I'm doing this. If they were to find out. I know. Only have to step outside to see how Albion treats people. What do you have for us? Proof that... <sighs> Proof that Nigel Cass was complicit in the bombings. What? But that's... Here, transfer it to this secure storage drive. How solid is this information? It's a recording of him talking to some... <laughs> you securely drop your weapon! Gather all our equipment and get it to the carousel. Do take that wall. Then get rid of this body. She can stay here. <laughs> Gang vengeance is an horrible crime, ain't it? Fuck me. Cass sent a squad of his goons for Claire and that other bloke. That recording's got to be the real deal. Bastard knew about the bombings. Albion must have Claire's equipment then, along with the audio file evidence. This has got to be the dirt we need to nail cast. And not just for Claire and well, what's her name, but for the other guy from earlier and the old guy from a while ago. Look, bad names, but you get the idea. The Albion dickhead mentioned Carousel. Must mean Carousel Plaza, right? Sounds like as good a place as any to start looking. 